Art history is dominated by men, the artwork by men. And that's, I think, why we're in a period where we're reevaluating uh, women's contributions to uh, the fine arts. So for us at the Center for Visual Art, um, it is a wonderful fit for our mission, which is to um, have a dialogue about contemporary urban issues through the lens of progressive contemporary art. I think women artists have been underrepresented, especially in abstraction. Uh, women really weren't recognized probably till the 1970s in general, uh, certainly in the United States, and probably not in, in Europe either. So what we can do is you know, make some strides in rectifying that and bringing attention to the artists that are working here in Colorado and really fantastic artists. We have artists who have been active for a couple of years. We have artists who have a 40-year career. We have people in between. And we have uh, artists who are no longer with us. There are four artists who have really set the stage and are more historic. And then the remainder are working today in Colorado. The historic artists I selected and with, uh, uh, I'm, I'm getting loans from the Kirkland Museum and from private collections here in town are Mary Chenoweth and Nadine Drummond, both of whom are painters. Mary Chenoweth was extraordinarily adventurous in her art. She did really starting in, in the 1950s. She was doing uh, early abstractions in Colorado. It's unusual for an artist that does very fine uh, realism and impressionism to do really fine abstraction, but Nadine Drummond was able to do that. We have two of Colorado's great sculptors in this show. Well, my son was a pilot and uh, for Delta, and uh, when he first became a, became a pilot with his wings of gold, I made uh, something that I called wings of gold. From it wasn't like it, but I was certainly had that th in my thoughts when I made my next piece. So that'll be in the show. It's, it's seven feet wide. It's a welded piece. Of the uh, over 600 Colorado uh, artists I have in Kirkland Museum, uh, over 200 uh, that I have are women artists. There will be two women in the Student Curated Gallery, and they are both alumni of Metropolitan State University of Denver. I don't have half the artists that were on my initial list, just because, you know, there's space limitations at the CVA. So just the idea of how many women, I have about 25, plus the historic artists, and there were definitely another 30 that could have been in the show, and just there wasn't room. The artists in this exhibition are successful, contemporary working artists. I think to have their work out in the world is absolutely exciting. I think there's a much broader audience for the artwork for each of these artists. It's a whole different sensibility. Uh, females bring a whole incredible different aspect to art. So this is a very hot topic, women in modern and contemporary art.